Oh, he's cruising with it. today so changing it up today we're going after the most elusive fish you can catch as an angler I've never caught one never even seen one in person that being said I don't fish for these all the time but I would absolutely love to catch one and I have tried in the past but I've never succeeded today we're gonna try and pull it off see if we can get a couple out of here now that I'm not frozen to death. I can actually throw some casts. Oh, not slip and fall into this. Damn. My feet were cold in the morning, but I think he's just venturing. Go, go. Come on. Nice one, nice one. Oh, he's taking a run. I don't want to get near that line. Really, I can't really do much. Get him, get him. Get him. <laughs> yeah, baby. <laughs> oh my god. Oh my lord. I, dude, I couldn't go anywhere. I looked over and I just saw like, I saw like the faint colors. He didn't go anywhere. He just dropped it and just stood right. I just saw the faint colors of the bobber and I was like, dude, it's underwater. <laughs> right, go up to my brown bag and grab, uh, open up the zipper and grab the white flag. The white bag? No, my, uh, my oh. The, the oh, the front white zipper. This thing? Well, you can grab that too, but grab the front zipper. In the front zipper, there's pliers. We're gonna have pliers to look at. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Bro, I'm so excited. You're the long one. You're not super that is my first muskie. Dude, that's awesome, dude. That is the first ski I've ever caught in my entire life. That is unreal. All right. Dude, that is an adrenaline rush. I have never caught one of those before. That's my first one. 36 inches he measured out to. The Emerald Shiner, baby. Right in that corner, just sitting along the wall. We knew it was gonna happen. It was just a matter of time. But that was probably one of the coolest things I've ever, ever had happen to me fishing. That, you know. That's our best. Hell yeah. I do it, man. Oh, he busted right at the bank. Oh. <laughs> Damn. Damn. Oh, dude. That was as soon as I casted him out, too. 
That was such a fast fish. I didn't just drag up this time so I get a decent close Don't stomp him Just landed this nice muskie. We got a quick measure on him, kept him in the water. He's 39, 38, I think. So he's a pretty nice fish. Get him out of the water for a quick pick here. Oh yeah. Awesome. Nice fish. These fish in this cold water are so lively. Like, I mean, I couldn't even hold on. Ready to go. Like Bailey said earlier, I've caught a bunch of them. That was his first one, but every time that excitement is the same. It's unlike any other fish. It's incredible. We got probably about two more hours, so hopefully we can get another one for you in those two hours. Oh, that's on the other side. Is my camera in the frame? So Rob. <laughs> yeah, pretty much. Started out a little bad. slow, but finally. Top four, landed two. Or missed four, landed two, dumped one right at the bank. For musky, from what I'm, you know, from what I, from my track record. My say, track record too. That's yeah. That's, that's a good day. That's like the best. I mean, that's the best I could ask for, considering I've never caught one until today. But we only fish the morning. It's noon right now, and we're already done. We yeah. can stick around for an evening bite and probably land at two least two more. more yeah. yeah. If we could figure but, out how to keep the hook in, and we could add like six today. Yeah, for real. But yeah, man, the impossible fish. No longer impossible. Not for me, at least. But I'm super happy I caught that fish. That was like, that was, that was the equivalent of me, like, shooting a nice buck. So, uh... You got bit I by the bug. I thoroughly enjoyed it. Next one's 40 plus. Yeah, 40 plus or bust. So, that's gonna be a wrap for this one. Like, subscribe for more videos. I'm gonna try to drop a lot this summer. It's gonna be really good. So, stick around. I'm telling you, it'll be worth it. Peace out. See you guys.